forget about all of this just for a minute just now don't give anything to the mind and tell me how what you see is any different from what I see and if it is any different then you come up and speak to me about it but I would really be very happy if all of you could just let's all look together and you tell me how it is any different because actually like actually Amba said yesterday that I'm saying the same thing you know every day I'm actually saying the same thing every day so let's make sure that we are actually listening now and then you have, if you have these questions about how do you see things, is it different and I keep saying no but let's go through it together so that there's no feeling that you are not understood because any time that it seems like it is not understood you bring it up and say this is where we differ this is not how I see it okay? so when our eyes are open there's a perception of this external world all the people all the events everything is happening in this seeming outside world For none of you I feel will have a confusion on this one when the senses are present then it seems like there is a world around us and this world of phenomena has all these events which happen this is called the external world then if the senses are closed then you will see that there is a internal world also. so like there were objects in the external world it seems like there is another internal world with different objects and what are the objects in the internal world? there are thoughts there is imagination there are sensations or emotions and emotions are basically just these sensations which we have labeled some we have labeled as anger some we have labeled as nervousness some we have labeled as joy but basically there is a sense of some sensational movement some energetic movement which is different from the regular thought so in the internal world all of these objects are perceived external world seemingly this world of atoms and molecules which is also energy ultimately is perceived internal world all these objects different forms of energy are perceived so it must be clear now that there is a perceiving going on whether it's internal, external, whatever that there is this process of perceiving which is happening now if you were to just check be aware that everything which is coming is either an external object or an internal object and you already know actually that there is a witnessing of all of this otherwise you would not be able to report <coughs> that this is there or not isn't it like this if the mind is coming you just look at it as another object let it come let it say whatever it is saying and you say okay internal object another internal object is coming so, and we see like this that all which is moving all of this is just coming and going whether seeming internally or externally then you can bring your attention to the body also so all the sensations which seem to appear are also objects, isn't it? 
it seems like a part of the body is pulsating, the heart is beating, there might be some pain which is experienced, some discomfort. All of these you will also see that they are internal objects. And there is a perceiving of all of these sensations also. So let's club all these sensations also as internal objects. Now forget about the distinction of internal and external. Everything that is appearing and disappearing, just phenomenal objects. Phenomena is appearing and phenomena is disappearing. And just check whether the witness of this these phenomena is that also appearing and disappearing or it seems to be constantly here? And it doesn't matter. Whatever is appearing, let it appear. Be completely open. Don't resist anything. Let all phenomena, let all objects come and go. Just very simply ask yourself, is that which is witnessing them is that also coming and going or it seems to be unmoving and unchanging? When I check, I see that it is completely unmoving and unchanging. Be vigilant. Don't let your mind confuse you with some visual representation of what I am saying. So don't make a picture of what I am saying. If the pictures are coming, let them also come and go. Imagination, just another phenomenal object. We are talking about the seeing, the witnessing which is aware of all of this, including the visuals that the mind might be trying to paint. So as I am checking now, I can see that this witnessing is completely untouched by any of this phenomenal movement. And then very simply I just check, is there any difference, is there any distance between myself and this witnessing, this awareness. And as I check, it's completely clear that where I am, this awareness is. And I am everywhere. There is nowhere that I can say that awareness is and I am not. And nowhere that I can say I am, but awareness is not. So as I see it now, I could never be a thing, I can never be an object, because all these objects are just coming and going. And this witnessing stays here untouched through all of this. This awareness is unmoved. Even the process of phenomenal witnessing, phenomenal seeing through the senses is witnessed by me.
Therefore, I must be this, this awareness, in this simplicity. And I see that no object, no phenomena, actually has any hold over me. All thoughts are allowed to come and go. All emotions can stay for as long as they like and eventually go. This body can do whatever sensations can happen. And in the same way, what is perceived through the senses is also completely free. And I remain this scene, untouched by any of this. So is there any difference in the way you see it and I see it? If there is a difference, then I would like to know. And remember that I'm asking about the way you see it, not about the way you think it or feel it. I would really like to know that when you actually look, can it really be any different? Has it ever been any different? And once you see that it is like this, then this is the realization of the self. Can we keep it that simple? Take away all the frills, all the bells and whistles, and just keep it this simple. I have already said that this is the way I see it. Is it any different from the way you see it? <laughs> 